Hello, beginners! Good morning! This is Wednesday and it is time for our geometry lesson. And we have a new tool today. Isn't that fun? Do you know what this is called? This is called a geoboard. Can you say geoboard? And with this geoboard, we are going to learn how to make different shapes with our geo board and our rubber band. So you should have a little bag that has few rubber bands in it. Don't lose them. You're gonna need all of them. And then um, you should have a geo board. Now, if I were to show you this line right here, this line right here, could you tell me how many dots do you see on this line? Just this line right here, just this one. There's a beginning, a middle, and an end, and then there's two in between. So what, how many do I have? Very good, I have five. Good job, five. Okay, excellent. So this is what we are going to do today. I'm gonna ask you to take one little rubber band and I want you to make a square on your geo board. So you can make it however, wherever you want to do it on your geo board, but it has to be a square. Now, who can tell me what a square is? How many sides does the square have? Rocio, how many sides? Josias, how many sides does a square have? Very good, it has four sides. So you're gonna take your rubber band and maybe you're gonna decide to do it over here. You don't have to, but it, if you want to, you can. So look, they're all spaced out exactly the same. See, this is as far from this, as this is 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 from this. It's all the same. So when you do this and it has four corners, then you have a square because the four sides are exactly the same. Very good. All right, excellent job. So once you have done your square, I want your mommy to let me see. Okay, I want your mommy to go ahead and put that square right here. So what I want you to do, because some of you might have too big, too... Okay, entonces para los padres, um, ese geo board tiene uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis en vez de cinco. Entonces yo quiero que ustedes hagan eso. Así. Y así. Así, esa parte no tienen que utilizarla. ¿Ok? Solamente esa parte porque hay cinco y hay cinco como ese. Hay cinco aquí y cinco aquí. Entonces, perfecto así. Entonces, yo quiero que ustedes hacen lo mismo que él hizo. De donde, no importa dónde él lo hizo, pero ustedes hacen lo mismo aquí. Que el hizo. Okay? All right. So your mommy is going to draw the exact same um, uh, square that you did on your, on your um, geo board. And then she's going to do this so that we can have the exact amount that we need. Okay, and then you don't need this. All right, so now I want you to take your little rubber band and make another square somewhere else. So you can decide to make another square like this. And so now your, your mommy or yourself can do it. So you have one open here and then you did this one and this one. So just go around and make your square. All right, very good. All right, 
do another square now. We're going to do it a few times. We're going to do it so we can fill up. So four more times we're going to make a square. So show me another square. You can do it exactly how you want to do it. So I'm going to choose to do it like so. Okay, so now your mommy can draw it over here. Cada vez que su niño hace un square, un, cuadra, un cuadrado, entonces ustedes lo hace aquí también. Good. Okay, so now make another one. Let's see. I'm gonna make mine like this. Yeah, it looks like a rhombus, doesn't it? But if I put it, if you look at it this way, it's exactly the same size. It has four sides and it has four corners. So that's also a square. You see? Very good. Excellent. Okay, let's do it one more time. And this time, make it bigger. So how can you make it bigger? How can you make a bigger square? Oh, I hope it's not gonna pop. Go slowly so it doesn't pop on you. <gasps> yeah, that's another square. Very good. So you didn't start at the top line. You started the second one right here. Miss Sarah started like this. So Miss Sarah's going to draw it like this. Good. Do you see how it's the same? In the middle. Good. Okay. Let's take it off. And now let's do one more. And you can do it however you want to do it. I think I want to do one like this. Another one right here. Like that. And so I'm going to do mine right here. Good. All right, so these are all of our squares. Okay, now, once you have done this, I want you to take your page and I want you to cut, where are my scissors? I want you, where are my scissors? I want you to cut, your geo board. So you can cut them like that. And you can ask your mommy to cut them for you. So that's one. So you're gonna cut your, li your little geo board, right? Like that. All right, and we can throw this in the trash can. And now you're gonna look at your geo boards over here. You're gonna look at all of them, put them in front of you. You're gonna look at all of them. So I'm just gonna go ahead and cut this. So they're all the same. There we go. And now look at all of them and I want you to sort them. I want you to sort your squares that you made on your geo boards by size. So I want you to put whether the biggest to the smallest or the smallest to the biggest. So which one, when you look at your squares, which one is the smallest square? Yes, these are small. Actually, all of these are the same, aren't they? All of these are the same. So they're all gonna be like this. And then, 
All of these are like this. They're gonna be all like that. And then which one is comes after these little squares? Is it gonna be this one, this one, or this one? Very good. This one is a little bit bigger, isn't it? If you look at it, it's a little bit bigger, but it's not quite as big as the other one. So that one goes right here. And then you've got the two others that are the same and that are the biggest one, right? And so that goes from the smallest to the to a little bit bigger to the biggest. Did you see that? So now you sorted your square. Very, very good. All right, now that you sorted your square, now that you sorted your squares, I'm gonna ask you something. Can you change your square into a rectangle? Can you change your square into a rectangle? Can you? You are right. I cannot trick you. Most people think that squares are not rectangles, but we know better, don't we? We know that a square is a special rectangle, right? The square right here is a special rectangle because it does have two parallel lines over here and then two parallel lines over here and corners, right angle, four of them, right? And, but it is a special rectangle because all the sides are the same. Very good. So that is why it is very special, isn't it? Okay, so our square cannot be changed into a rectangle because it's already a special rectangle. Now, we're going to do the same thing that we just did, but we're going to make rectangles. Are you ready? Good, let's do it. Okay. So, are you ready to change your square and just make regular rectangles? So, you can even take if you, I think I put a couple rubber bands that are a little bit bigger. Yo puse unas que son un poquito más grande también. Pueden utilizar esas. Esa es muy grande. Pero quizás una de ese tamaño, si tienen. Okay, so let's make rectangles. So we're going to put all of our squares aside. Over here, we're going to take our paper again with our pencil, and we're going to make rectangles. Now remember rectangles, two sides are small, and then two sides are long. All right, very good. So let me make one. So this side is going to be the long one. And then this is going to be, oh, right here. These two sides are the short sides and these two sides are the long sides. And that's a rectangle. Very good. So same thing that we did before. Go ahead and take care of this right away. That way it's done. Okay, excellent. So now I'm gonna look here and I'm gonna start at the bottom and go up one, then go to the side one and that is where we started, isn't it? So right here, I go up one and then I go to the side one time and another time, because remember this is the long side and now this is the short side. And then we go again and again, and we have our long side. So this is our rectangle. Very good. So go ahead and practice making rectangles. So I'm going to make another one. This one, I'm going to make it bigger. And I think I'm going to make it like this. I'm going to make it really big, like this. You see how I did this rectangle? 
So I started at the bottom right here and I went up one, two times. One, two. And then I went one, two, three. So one, two, three. And then down and then over here. Now I'm making another rectangle. Did you see that? Good. Okay. Let's make another one. We can make all kinds of rectangle. We could make a giant one like this or like, what if we made it all the way down there? Oh, look at that one. That one is really big. So we started right here at the bottom and we went all the way to the top. So we went all the way to the top one and then, oops. Then we went one, two, one, two, and then we went all the way down to the bottom, and then one, two. And that's a big rectangle. Big rectangle. Good job. And now we could do another one that's even bigger. Let's hope that our elastic doesn't pop. So we're gonna go really slow. Oh. How about if we did this? Do you think it's gonna work? Let's see. Let's see if it's gonna work. My Sarah's pushing it. Oh! Oh! We did it! Yes! Look at this! How big it is! So we can decide to look at it like this, or we could look at it like this too, right? As long as this is the long two parallel sides that are long and two parallel sides that are shorter. So this one starts at the very top and goes all the way to the other end. So we go like this, and then we go down one, two, three. One, two, three, right? And then one, two, three, same, because these two are the same size. And then the other one is the long sides like that one. Good, so we have another rectangle. All right, very good, let's do another one. We have two more to go. So let's make another, let's make a little one this time. And we're gonna make it at the top. We can make it like this. One, two, down one, one, two, up one. Good. And now maybe we could make a longer one. How about if we did it like this? There we go. Look at this. So this time we went one, two, three. One, two, three. Down one. One, two, three. Up one. Good. Okay, so now that you have this page, you can go ahead and cut your rectangle. So same thing that we did before. We're gonna cut our geo boards and we are gonna sort them together. So we have one here. Up. Just like that. Isn't that wonderful that a rectangle is always the same? It has two long sides and two short sides that are parallel. It never changed. A rectangle is always like that. And, our, and a square is always the same size all around. The four sides are the same. It's always the same, it never changes. Do you remember who is just like that? Who never changed, who's always the same yesterday, today, and forever? That's right, it's God. God is like that. He never changes. He's always the same, always a loving God, always a patient God, always a God who takes care of us, 
and never abandon us. We are never alone. He's always with us. God never changed. Just like a rectangle is always two long sides and two short sides. And a square is always four sides that are the same size. All right, very good. So now that we have our now that we have our rectangle, let's look at them. So we're just gonna put them in front of us and we're going to look at them. Let me see. Okay, it's still videoing, good. All right, so let's look at our rectangle over here. And we are gonna place them from the biggest to the smallest. So let's look at all of them. Which one do you think is the biggest? This one, this one, this one, this one, this one, or this one? Yes, you can see it, can't you? This is the biggest. So then which one is the one that is a little bit less big? A little bit less big. Let's see, I didn't do really good on that line. Let me make it straighter. There we go. Which one is less big? Yes, a little smaller. This one is a little smaller. Very good. How about the next one? Which one do you think is a little smaller? Very good. This one is, right? You see how it's a little bit shorter? This one is a little bit longer. Good. Okay, so what comes right after this one? Yes, which one is a little bit smaller than this one? But not the smallest. That's right, this one is. And then look at these two. What would you say these two are? They're the same size. So we're just gonna put them right there, right beside each other, because they're the same. Okay, so it went from the biggest to the smallest. Very good. Good job, beginners. You did excellent. All right, we'll see you tomorrow.